This was an absolutely devastating fire. You can see behind me what remains of this mobile home here in Emily City. Three children lost their lives and four people are now in critical condition. The entire town is going to be mourning and hurting for this. Scott Pike is the police chief in Emily City. He says around 3 a.m. Tuesday morning, his crews responded to a fire here on Magnolia Drive at the Maple Grove Trailer Park. Mobile home was uh, completely engulfed in flames. The first half was just completely burning and there was a uh, woman outside screaming. The distraught woman lived in the home, according to Pike. He says she was the mother and the rest of her family was still inside. It was burning too hot. The officer couldn't make entry. Fire department arrived just minutes later. They were able to make entry into the trailer and they recovered six people from the trailer. Crews were able to get everyone out, but three of the children had already passed away. A three-year-old girl and a five and six-year-old boy. A one-month-old girl and an 18-month-old boy and the father of the children were all able to make it out alive. But all of them, including the mother, are now in critical condition. Emily City Community Schools Superintendent Stu Cameron says it has been a hard day for the community and the school district. We lost three of our um, cherished students um, and that we have help available for um, every student in the building, anybody that requires help. In light of the fire, Pike adds that the community has been coming together. He says people have been stopping in at the police station all day trying to figure out how they can help this family. Pray, pray a lot. We've got four people still struggling for their lives. Police say they're not sure exactly what caused this fire, but they believe it could be linked to a portable heater that was in the home. They also are not releasing the names of the victims until tomorrow. In Emily City, Rachel McCrary, WNEM TV5.